and the circle. I've forgotten who their leader is. My brother deserves to suffer. Just like I have suffered all of these years. And when he sees his city burn with his family to blame, he will. Overwatch, we're on site. We're in the telecom suite. BC Laurel and Wild Dog are still en route. I'm picking up over 100 heat signatures in the building, including the penthouse that is still under construction. With well, one guess as to where your sister is. She really knows how to maximize collateral damage, doesn't she? If we try to evacuate the civilians, we'll blow our cover. We need to find that relay trigger before the night circle knows we're here. Actually, just the device will land the signal. There's a power surge coming from the moon you're in, so the relay must be somewhere nearby. We should have done Amico's ability to detonate. We saved the city. Find the relay device, and then evacuate the building. Are you going after Amico? I've got your back. Gotta go along. Communication is mission critical. The last thing we need are comms failing while we're out there. While we're out there? Sounds like you still haven't budged on Mia and William taking the reins. We are about to stop a small army from infiltrating Star City. I can't be the only one worried about the kids. Of course I'm worried. But I taught Zoe everything she knows about being a hero. Almost everything. And now my little girl's a grown-ass woman in one of the canaries. I know she can handle herself. And your kids, they're no slouches either, Felicity. They're like their parents. This is not the life that Oliver and I wanted for them. They're supposed to be living happy, normal lives right now. And that was the only thing that Oliver asked me to do. It was the only thing that I promised him I would do. I failed. It's time. Be safe. I love you. I love you too, Dad. I'm gonna be watching over both of you. I need you. 